What's going on guys, welcome back to another video. So in this video, we're gonna be taking a look at some more really successful Facebook ads. If you're new to Shopify, new to dropshipping Facebook ads, then I think it's really important to spend as much time as possible um, looking and analyzing um, people who are doing it successfully. So one of the things that I like to do um, every single week and kind of put it out on my YouTube channel is using certain softwares and tools I find successful Facebook ads, Facebook ads that are current. So both of these examples I'm gonna show you today are still running today. Um, and by finding these successful Facebook ad examples, we get to find a lot more information too. So obviously we have the actual products that they're selling and we can see their Shopify store and essentially we can see the entire setup of this business. So if you're still yet to start your store and you're looking for a product and a type of store um, to actually start with, then there's some great inspiration that you can take take um, from this video. I actually really enjoy producing these videos too for you guys because it forces me to spend time looking at people doing it successfully too. So I've discovered some great products doing this um, and today's video is gonna be no exception. Both of these products I've never actually seen before um, and they seem to be performing really, really well. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Thanks for tuning in um, and let's jump straight into it. Okay, so here we are at the first Facebook ad. Before I actually show you it then, let's show you some proof, some evidence behind and why um, it's actually being featured and spoken about in this video and why it deserves to be spoken about as well. So first of all, if we take a look at the information in the top right corner, this is a post that was created back on Wednesday, December 15th, um, 2021. It was first seen on Friday, December 24th, 2021, and it was last seen today, the actual date I'm recording this video. So what this tells us is that this is an ad, a post that's been running for over 12 months. An ad doesn't run for that long unless it's making money. So the guys that are paying to use this as an ad must be seeing a return on that. So what this also tells us is that this is an ad, this is a product, this is a creative that's working right now. So if you're looking for products to sell, this is definitely one that's worth considering. We can also see that it's been active for that long too. So if we take a look at the tracking results since the very beginning, what we can see is there's been a steady incline over time. So what that actually shows is that it's been running in for that amount of time as well. If we were to see kind of like one place or one particular kind of period where the engagement doesn't go up, what that shows is that essentially nobody's seeing it because when people see it, that's when people engage. The fact that it keeps going up and up and up um, for over 12 months is a great sign that all in all, it's a pretty evergreen product. It's a pretty organic product that should sell all year round. As for the engagement on this product, then you've probably seen it already. Um, 8,000 likes, so over 10,000 reactions, which is awesome. We can see it's had 2,000 shares and over 2,000 comments too. Um, this is the actual ad creative itself. In fact, let's take a look at it on Facebook so we can see exactly how it would be displayed. Um, if you ask me, the actual text at the top um, could be more kind of consolidated um, and displayed in a more user-friendly way. Um, however, the proof is in the pudding, so to speak, um, and they're obviously seeing some decent results even with this quite hectic um, primary text at the top. So with that being said, let's take a look at the ad itself. So that was the ad then, as you can see, very short, sharp, to the point, super simple. Wouldn't surprise me if they took this content from a supplier on AliExpress. Even so, filming this kind of content yourself would be so easy to do. You haven't, ha you haven't got to have confidence on camera. It doesn't show anybody's face. There's nobody speaking about the product. It's simply somebody unboxing it um, and then kind of like some B-roll footage really um, of the product. So super easy and yet super effective. If we take a look at some further proof of why this is such a great product, um, it's always a good idea to check out the comments and see what people are saying about it. So um, nothing we can really take from these ones. Um, I'm an adult and I want one, they're so cute. They need to make a penguin, just ordered one for my son. So this is exactly what we're looking for. We're looking for evidence that people have actually spent their hard earned money on this product. And if you can see people that actually um, buying the products, then we know that it's not just an ad that's good for engagement. It's actually an ad that's good for making sales as well. So we can also see somebody else commenting saying they got theirs. They're mentioning the batteries in which you need, well worth the investment, so another happy customer. Um, we can see that this person here is saying they've just 
just received mine. So that's three people we know have bought it. Now, obviously you can't build a business on three people, but not everybody is gonna come back here and say they've bought one. The fact that there's evidence and signs of people buying this product um, is exactly what we're looking for. Let's take a look at their Shopify store then, because even this shocks me, to be honest. Um, I look at a lot of Shopify stores. I've built a lot of Shopify stores. Um, and to be honest, if one of my students sent me this store um, and said, I wanna go ahead with this, then I probably wouldn't let them do so because there's so much that could be done to this store to improve it. For example, they haven't even got a logo at the top. So it just goes to show the power of having a really cool product that people want to buy. You can have, without being too mean, this store is quite amateurish without being too horrible, but they have a great product and it obviously does exactly what it needs to do. Um, they even only have a couple of reviews at the bottom and yet people are still buying this product. So it just goes to show, as I said earlier, the power in having a great product and putting it in front of the right audience. As for profit margins on this product then, so they're selling it for $40. They've got like a 50% off deal running at the moment. Um, I've actually found this product on AliExpress and what you can see is the cost of this product is under $15. So there's over $25 um, profit per sale, which is a great amount. Definitely workable on Facebook. I like to work in and around sort of $15 to $20. So these guys are probably making a comfortable profit per sale on the front end. Um, so overall, they should be super profitable because they'll be able to use those existing customers to remarket to um, at a fraction of the price in the form of SMS messaging or email marketing, or even just retargeting on Facebook, but with a different product. And so with that being said, that is product number one. We'll move on to product number two in a second. I just wanna take a quick minute to say, if you're still watching this video, I really appreciate it. Um, all the support on the channel recently has been awesome. Um, so please do keep it coming. I've also had a few people ask me about my mentorship program program. Um, if you are looking for more information on that, make sure you check out the links um, below this video. And with that being said, then let's move swiftly on to product number two. Okay, so here we are on product number two. Um, now, if you're familiar with the type of content that I put out um, in regards to Shopify and dropshipping and e-commerce, you'll know that I'm not one person you'll know that I'm not a person, sorry, to say that dropshipping is easy. In fact, I say the opposite. But if you are looking for the easiest possible way to make money with dropshipping, then you have to take a look at this ad and this product. So first of all, then let's start with the proof. The post creation was November 4th, 2021. So it hasn't been running quite as long as that previous product, but it's still been running for the last three months or so. And it was still last seen today as well. So this is still a product that's currently active and currently performing. As for the reactions and the engagements, we can see in the bottom left corner here, um, 6,000 likes, 500 heart emojis or heart reactions, I should say, um, 370 shares and 800 comments. So not quite the amount of engagement um, as the previous one, but when you actually pro router it um, over the same period of time, this actually has a lot more engagement per week of being ran or per month um, of actually being created. So with that being said, then let's take a look at the actual ad on Facebook. And when I say this has got to be one of the easiest ways to make money with dropshipping in the simplest form, just wait until you see um, this Facebook ad. So yep, that's it. There's nothing else to it. It's literally just a GIF, um, pretty much, of those arrows flashing, pointing to the, um, uh, what you call it, the pendants on the bracelet saying your kids. So it's pretty self-explanatory. It's pretty much to the point. It's a bracelet in which you can get your kids' names on. So it's quite a heartfelt, it's quite a nice product, to be honest. Um, super simple at the top. He'll never take it off. Surprising with a bracelet um, engraved with your family's names, birthdays, well wishes, so on and so forth. Um, we can see that it's effective judging by the amount of engagements that it's got. Um, what's also really good about this product, I found it on AliExpress. It is something you can actually drop ship from AliExpress. Because it is essentially a print on demand product um, because they'll have to print whatever it is the message is onto the pendants then customers won't mind or they'll expect to wait a week or two for delivery because it's made to order so that kind of gets you around that um, slight speed bump of people complaining about delivery times you won't get that with this product because people will expect to have to wait for a product that's made to order as for the comments like the previous Facebook post, it's always important to check out the comments to find evidence that people are actually buying this. This is what 
there's only really one way to tell if there's demand for a product and that's to go into the comments and see if people have actually bought it. So Rick says he's arrived yesterday and he absolutely loves it. Um, somebody said they bought one with four names, came in decent time and it's really nice. My husband likes it. My daughter bought me with one. I have mine a few years now with the kids and the wife's names on. Um, pretty Almost every single one of these comments is about having bought this product which is a really really strong sign um, that it's a good product and people actually want to buy it bobby stone said my girlfriend gave me one for christmas and i love it derek says my wife got me one for christmas um, so there's loads and loads of people basically saying they've actually bought this product and one thing i actually forgot to do on the previous facebook post was filter by newest to see just how recently people are commenting and we can see people commented as most recent as recent as um, 30 minutes ago so it's still active still doing well and if, again if you're looking for a product to go out and sell um, in the coming weeks this would definitely be a great example let's also take a look at these guys Shopify store and again without sounding mean this looks so basic it looks so amateurish but it just goes to show when you have such a good powerful products that people want regardless of anything else um, they'll be willing to buy it and the price at $24 is super cheap. Um, it fits within that kind of impulse buy range. People won't really question spending that much on a made to order product. And if we actually take a look at the product on AliExpress, you can see you can get it for as little as $8. So the profit margins aren't quite as good with the previous product, but if you have a product that gets loads and loads of attention and you have really cheap CPMs and you can gather a lot of kind of hype and belief and a high conversion rate essentially for on a Facebook ad, then you can afford to kind of bring those profit margins down a little bit um, and still be successful as these guys quite obviously are. Now, as for these boxes, um, putting names in and things like that, there's certain apps you can get um, which will do that for you. They're usually in and around sort of $20 a month for a decent app, so there is that to consider. But even so, it's neither here nor there. Perhaps if you guys wanna see a tutorial on how to set up a customization product page like this, um, just let me know in the comment section down below. So let's just have a scroll through then, take a look at the rest of the product page. You can see it's just the default font. They've got a pretty nice GIF here actually, which makes it look like um, kind of features a bit of the manufacturing process, which is a nice touch. Same thing for this. It's quite obviously a product that's um, aimed towards a male person. Um, and probably, as we saw in the comments, actually, it's probably aimed at women, but it's a product for men because it's the sort of products that a wife or a girlfriend might might buy for their partner. They actually have some screenshots of certifications here, which I've never seen before in a Shopify store before. Um, in my opinion, they're probably not necessary, but I'm not gonna question it. They are quite clearly making money with this, so it seems to be working for them. They have this font here, which is in, I think the same text, but it's larger and it's in bold. Um, if we scroll down, there's not even any reviews on this Shopify store. If these guys are making money, they're going to be making money with a page like this. If they just spent a bit of extra time or used a better theme, um, I think they could make even more money. And so with that being said, then guys, I'm going to wrap the video up there. Um, hopefully you've stuck with me this long. If you have, I really do appreciate it. The support on the channel recently has been awesome. Make sure you let me know if you are still watching. Leave a comment down below or hit a like on this video for me. And one final quick message then before you go. If you are looking for a one-on-one -on -one mentorship, program uh, make sure you check out my ecom accelerator program if you want more information on it just comment the word accelerator down below um, it's quite exclusive to be honest i only choose to work with five people every single month at the moment we are full but there is a waiting list and whenever those spots come up then you'll get an email to book a call with me um, just for 20 30 minutes we can have a chat about what your goals are and how i can help you achieve them thanks for watching guys i'll see you in the next one